Indonesia is so famous about the food yeah because we have I search in Google 5600 something and my content I already make more than 250 video about food and different food so you can imagine I can bring new food every day every time when I go to the beach uh, I come to the beach and then I choose random people to try Indonesian food many people refuse and many other people would like to join the specific food there is some controversial about that example a gado gado from Jakarta but yeah. half of people from Java they claim that gado gado is from their area so that's make my comment section fighting yeah, each other I, yeah, <laughs> hey, from my, good topic no? yeah, good topic good topic <laughs> say something <laughs> hi mom hi dad <laughs> hi mom hi dad that's the first thing best son i think i'm the i'm the worst son i think yeah i mean not only worse my parents are the worst <laughs> yes. how long you been doing this uh youtube uh maybe around five years five years yeah five years wow well you, you have like 280k followers now how, how long did it take to grow um you know, I start my video first time when I invited by the governor of Timor Leste. You know, oh, you Timor got Leste in... is the country uh, next Indonesia. Okay, Before, there, is a, there is a country called yes, uh, Timor, Timor Leste. Timor Leste. Yes, I don't even know. Oh yeah, I need to learn my geography now. Uh, you know Komodo Island. Yeah, I know. Komodo yeah, Island. it's near Komodo Island. Before yeah. Timor Leste is part of Indonesia. Yeah, and. 1999 or, or 2000 they separate okay uh, from Indonesia. is that is that the time they, there was war happened yes okay okay so uh when i invite i'm not youtuber uh, i'm not youtuber at the moment i'm not social i'm not into social media okay yeah but i'm uh, a, a party planner my main job is party planner when, when was that like nine 2000s or uh 2018 maybe 2018 okay. yeah 2018 and then I came to the to Timor Leste and make documentation like amateur. I just uh, make some documentation report for my job. And then after I back again to Indonesia, I uh, upload it to YouTube and boom, you know, one million people watching less than one month. <laughs> less than one month, one <laughs> million people one watching. Years. Indonesian netizens are so crazy, no? Yes. You they're know. like, they, they love you or they hate you. There's no yeah. in between. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. How, how do you handle with the uh, netizens? Oh, you know, uh, my content uh, so far is about uh, Indonesian pride. I, okay, it's about yeah. the food, right? Yeah, mainly. about the food, about the culture. So I introducing Indonesian food to foreigners. So you know, basically, Indonesian people love to see that if the if foreigners uh, like something about us, hmm. food, culture, they will watch. Why, why do you think Indonesian uh, like people love to see a foreigner liking uh, local people or uh, pr like saying good things about Indonesia? Of course, because Indonesian people are famous about his pride to the nation. Okay. Yeah, we are nationalist people. So we're proud if the foreigners uh, love to eat, to try our food, and to love our culture. Wow. That's uh, the typical of Indonesian netizen. They will love everything, your, your content, and uh, mostly my content is about something like that mm -hmm. so there is no hate speech about my content yeah i mean yeah. it's mainly the food right everybody yes. loves food nobody yes. hates food mm -hmm. and, and if i see the uh, algorithm uh, in the youtube system i think 96 97 percent give thumb up really yes i mean i get like thumbs up all the time mm -hmm. uh, very rarely i get negative comment mm -hmm. these days but uh i i struggle to know what people likes to know Mm -hmm. It's it's for me. It's because I'm trying to push a content. It's not only for Indonesians. Mm. It's for, because it's English. It, it could go all over the world. Yeah. So that was my focus. Even though, like, I know if I put something about Bali mm. all the time, mm. people I'll get more views. Yeah. But but I don't want that. I want to way so that I can put everything and people watch it. You know, I want mm. everybody to. If I, if let's say if I go to Thailand, right? Mm. I if I put 
Thailand stuff. People mm. has to watch it. I want that mm. way rather mm. like a, I'm going to ba- talk about Bali all the time mm. Mm. because you can run out of shit yes. talking about because yes. sometimes th- th- there was issue Bali and Bali and local mm. uh, like two months ago. Now it's slowed down. I, I don't think there's a lot of heat <laughs> going anymore. So, so you will eventually run out of stuff. I mean, it's not about, I mean, the podcast is the main reason you it's it affects your whole life rather mm, mm. only learn a little bit right mm, mm. but yeah i mean your content is more your niche right yes yes um, um yeah yeah my, my niche is about food culture indonesian food and also uh the bikini girl <laughs> is it that, that i want to ask that right <laughs> <laughs> is it something to attract the audience for bikini uh, you recording mainly on the beach because yes. if you record on the be- beach mainly most of the people foreigners of course mm. always on the bikini yeah, or yeah. like on a swim shorts um <laughs> is it and also your thumbnails are more <laughs> yeah. mainly bikini i'm like yeah. okay i'm going to go click in to, click this, to yeah. see some yeah. kind of bikini girl Yeah. Is it to uh, to get impression clicks? Yes, yes, of course. But my content is not about clickbait, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I uh, present beautiful girls. Yeah, uh, honestly, when I go to the beach, I, I will choose uh, which people I will come. Okay. Yeah, not only bikini girls, of course, yeah. but yeah, interesting people. If I saw, if I saw you in, in the beach, maybe I will come to you. I don't know, maybe yeah. you don't. <laughs> <laughs> you got a more handsome yeah, person. Yeah. But how do you do it? You walk around the beach couple times and see people yes. before you approach them or how do you approach them? Uh no, just instantly uh, I come to the beach and then I choose random people to to try Indonesian food. Uh, and many people refuse and many other people would like to join. What is the join. percentage of refusing? When I bring any food meat food something uh they oh, are vegetarian, the vegetarian they're vegan, vegan, huh? they're vegan. They're, <laughs> i'm sorry i'm vegan <laughs> or maybe uh they staring me like what you are random people uh yeah. ask me to eat your food something like that <laughs> yeah but it's normal for me it's any okay. any yeah. crazy stories there ah uh, um crazy stories uh, one day i bring some grasshopper fried grasshopper oh, people, fried grasshopper yeah, crazy why you want to poison me poisoning me something like that yeah yeah so Cra- crazy grasshopper i would say yeah. no too <laughs> you know you know grasshopper fried grasshopper i i don't eat never try no, it man. <laughs> okay i mean uh, in thailand they sell it on the mm. uh, on the street yeah, yeah but yeah. here not a lot but uh, mm. no i mean the people likes to eat crickets it's it's the same thing right grasshopper yeah 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 yeah, yeah. but same, same how thing. they are crunchy crunchy and you know uh, how how do they how do they taste for me it's good because a lot of protein in there right protein protein yeah really and it's good, only like a little thing yeah right? but uh, i bring up a, a basket of grasshopper <laughs> so people try you think they are chips <laughs> <laughs> yeah but but uh, you you supposed to try it, so you time. tried it yes of course uh, i try uh, first to make sure that i'm not liar I am not uh want to make something criminal to you so yeah. I, I try first. Did anybody got side effects uh, by trying your food? So far no. So far no so nobody far, else. No, nobody, yeah, I, I don't, I don't, I, yeah I hope that is not happen. Yeah. Yeah because uh before I bring some food of course I make kind of a survey to the place the hygienity and uh the score in go food you know. Yeah. Usually I use go food or grab food to 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 see uh which which restaurant have uh, good food quality control quality control But I, I in Indonesia there is not a lot of quality control on the food yes because uh, there is no system to put into if you have a restaurant you need to have all the yeah uh legalities and formalities mm-hmm. because mm-hmm. in US if you starting a restaurant yeah you have so many checklists to mm-hmm. Uh, make yes. sure everything is right if something is like even dirty on the corner yeah, yeah. if the uh, food inspector comes and looks at it mm-hmm. you get cancelled yeah I, i just try before i bring this to the beach one day before i go to the restaurant and i make appointment uh, tomorrow i will have shooting but before shooting before filming i will uh, try this first and i want to know is there any effect to me something like that how hard it is to go through all this process uh 
first is i think this is very hard process because i just only uh, with my photographer uh, cameraman sorry i just uh, just two of us the hard process is about to maintain how to bring the food you know some time keep food, it warm yeah, yes sometimes uh, food need to keep it warm and how how to make everything look still delicious when yeah, i because bring food is very delicacy yes, right you can yes. ruin it by mm -hmm. just keeping under your mm -hmm. bike seat for mm -hmm. a little bit mm -hmm. and it ruins yeah so yeah to maintain all that how how, how hard it, i mean I, yeah. you enjoy all this process or of course i enjoy because i love to eat some yeah i love to eat i love to see people reaction when they try uh, the new food something like that so uh, maybe uh, the example i go to the restaurant at 2:30 or 3 p.m. and then I'm filming about one hour and then go to the pit. So need maybe one and one and a half hour until I see people on the pit something like that. Okay, well, interesting. But yeah, you know, Indonesia is so uh, famous about the food. Yeah, because we have I search in Google 5,600 something and my content I I already make. More than 250 video about food and different food. So you can imagine, I can uh, bring new food every day, every time when I go to the beach. Did you try any Balinese food? Yes, of course. What is Balinese food? Babi guling. Yes, babi guling. Um, rujak kuah pindang. Have you tried that? No. A uh, kind of Balinese salad. Balinese salad. Okay. Yeah, Balinese salad. Um, ayam betutu. Ayam betutu. I think. Yeah, I, uh, yeah, I know that. Yeah, you yeah. know that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. But not uh, only Balinese food. Actually, I promoting Indonesian food. Yeah. Many kind of Indonesian food from from the west to the east to north to the. South. How many? Uh, uh, how many? Like five thousand six hundred food types are there? That sounds. Uh, I get so many comments when in the last bites I said only have less food no. here. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I got so many comments, bro. You need to you yeah, need to try lot of yeah, Indonesian yeah, yeah. food. I'm so like, me as example, you know, uh, from five years ago until now, I still can explore many new food. They can be like five thousand or six thousand mm, food, but mm. people only eat small yeah. summer yeah. types of food, right? Yeah, the yeah. reason it's it's uh, easy mm -hmm. to make. Yeah, is, yeah. Is it the reason or uh, why they only eat certain amounts of food, but they don't eat everything else all the time? I don't know. That does make me wonder why uh, foreigners only know about um, nasi goreng, gado gado. Yeah, it's a, uh, I want to ask like, is gado gado only famous for foreigners, or is it famous for Indonesians? Is the number one food Indonesia, Indonesia famous in Indonesia, and mostly uh, the specific food. There is some controversial about that because uh, people. So uh, people understand that gado-gado uh, is come from their area. Example, gado-gado uh, from Jakarta. But yeah. half of people uh, from Java, they claim that gado-gado is from their area. So that's make my comment section... Fighting yeah, each other. I, yeah. <laughs> hey, my... Good topic, no? <laughs> good topic, good topic. Yeah. <laughs> good topic to get interaction. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I mean, that's what I like to know because what is... Uh, most favorite indonesian food for mm -hmm. indonesians mm -hmm. not foreigners mm -hmm. what is it like it's not i don't think it's gado gado no no uh beef rendang beef rendang beef rendang i like beef rendang oh yeah yeah i like the sauce it's uh from... i mean there is like a little bit of uh indian in yes, there yes, i think yes, yeah. yes 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 yeah. i think like that is that uh, from authentic paru or from javanese warung is like more more it's beef rendang is javanese but beef right? rendang is not from java Su no? sumatra sumatra yeah West okay. sumatra Beef rendang from Sumatra. Many you can see uh, soto, soto ayam. So, soto ayam. Yeah. But you know, soto ayam is just only um, common name for like a general name, uh, soto ayam. But if you want to know uh, soto ayam, there is many type of soto ayam. There is soto betawi. Uh, sorry, I just call soto yeah, not ayam. Ayam is chicken, right? Yeah, I know. Soto, yeah. yeah. The, yeah. the name of soto. Soto is a soup. Then soup, you put yeah. any kind of yeah, any meat kind of in there. Meat in there. Yeah. There is soto Betawi, soto Surabaya, soto Bogor, many. What's your favorite food? Ah, you know, every lunch time make me confused. You know, make me. <sighs> I understand you because yeah, I like to eat different all the time. Yes, so. yes, yes. Me too. I, I like to eat something different every every time. Lunch time and dinner time make me confused. Oh, what what else? You know? 
Ya, yeah, uh, but my 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 favorite nasi goreng always save me. Ah, uh, come on, man. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna sit here and say nasi goreng, and you just said all the foreigners only know nasi goreng. Yeah, me too. No, no, no. Nasi goreng is delicious, but um, rendang also my favorite. Uh, Or bakso on the street. Ah, <laughs> uh, bakso yeah. yeah, yeah, bakso also my my favorite. The bakso yeah, on the street, but not on yeah. You know, uh, on the street, not really good, not really. Because delicious. they put it in the plastic. I don't like yeah. it. Yeah. Because one day I was eating uh, with the plastic, and my mm. friend is like, "Why are you eating that? It's plastic." Mm. I'm mm. like, well, "Yeah, whatever. It tastes good." Yeah, yeah. yeah. But you're also eating. Oh yeah, the I have many complaints about that about plastic. Yeah, but because before before it's see. Mm. Bakso is always hot in yeah. the can, right? And they put it in the plastic cover, Not and they good. mix it with all the sauces, yeah. and they give it to you. Yeah, and yeah. I seen local people eating just the mm. cover; they mm. just rip mm. it off at one part, yeah. and they just eat it like yeah. this. So you're eating plastic at the same time because the hot yeah. melts the plastic. Mm. Mm. So yeah, I mean it's weird. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, before maybe two years ago, starting from two years ago, I not. Uh, Using plastic anymore when I bring uh, foreigners food because I got many complaint about the plastic. Why why you why you bring plastic? Plastic is not good. Uh, mix with soup or something like like because chemical. Because foreigners blah, blah. don't touch. Mm-hmm. If bakso is giving it in uh, plastic, mm-hmm. bak- foreigners don't touch because they mm-hmm. know mm-hmm. the plastic ma- material melts with hot. Mm-hmm. So that is the reason they don't eat mm-hmm. it. Like I seen my friends said it, but after that I never ate it. I mm-hmm. I tried once, then I didn't realize mm-hmm. until mm-hmm. I ate. I'm I'm like I am hungry. I need to eat. That's <laughs> the only thing in my head. Mm-hmm. But my friends are like, how are you how are you eating this? I'm like. What's the problem? You're like that's in the plastic. Oh, that's when I realized. Yeah. That's yeah. when I'm like, okay, now should I eat this or no? Yeah. But then I ate it. I'm like, what the fuck? Whatever. But if you eat uh, directly on the spot, uh, you don't need plastic, right? They have bowl. Just put in the bowl. But in uh, like, is it like a local uh, on the cart, right? On the street, yeah, they they the have cart. bowls. Yes, Are, they have bowls. Okay. Yeah. Because I haven't seen. Uh, mostly, I seen people just carrying it because oh, I sit no, at a local no. co- coffee place and people. Get it there and just eat it. Oh. So then I seen people eating in the okay. plastic. This uh, is for make sure everything that uh, you can eat directly on the spot when you stop the bakso yeah. on the street. Okay, I want to eat here. Yeah, they will give you. Yeah, bowl. okay. Mm-hmm. But they how do they clean because they're always on the street. Yeah, that's why. <laughs> <laughs> What is the local food which is really good? Not not a lot of people try it. Um, you know. Tourism area only concentrate in Bali. They never go to Java or any other part in Indonesia. So in Java, you know, the most population island in Indonesia is Java, and also in the world, maybe number seven in the world, the most population island. So there is many kind of food that uh, maybe foreigners never try before, and uh, kind of yeah, many rare. Uh, maybe you 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 feel strange about that. If you try the organ, you know, okay, uh, like kidneys. Yeah, and, yes. But I think uh, you can eat chicken kidneys, and the people have tried it probably. Mm-hmm. But w- w- what's the food you know that people don't try a lot, even Indonesians? Oh yeah, rujak cingur. Rujak cingur. Rujak cingur. Rujak cingur. Rujak cingur. Cingur. Cingur is uh, nose and lips uh, of the cow. Is nose and lips of a cow. Yeah, yeah. Have yeah. you seen they, they, a cow they, they, like on the on the farm and always sneezing and drooling and you're gonna? But eat? after processing, he genius, you know, he clean and then uh, they processing, they cook it. So of course, will hygienic. You know, the the part of the cow, uh, nose and lips. Cut and then uh, be the special food, rojak cingur. Yeah, you supposed to try. Maybe um, I don't think I'm yeah. gonna try it. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe one day I can invite you to my channel and try Indonesian food. Yeah. Yeah, I'll Rujak try Indonesian Cingur, yeah. food, but <laughs> 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 nothing, okay. anything is too illegal. <laughs> you know, in, uh, Indonesian food mostly not really instra- Instagramable. Uh, not really look good. Not really look aesthetic, but. Okay, not imagine about something. Maybe I will uh, close your eyes with with clothes. No, bro. And then, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you see, uh, I. I will. I will talk. I, I will think not... I'll puke on the camera. <laughs> I don't think it's a good idea. I will uh, not 
not mention about it's come from what so yeah, yeah. just just a kind of a mystery food for you yeah? no the reason is my my nose is so so strong like mm-hmm. uh as a grown in uh like indian family mm-hmm. and uh, in us the food is very processed mm-hmm. there is not a lot of be you know like a meat smell right mm-hmm. that meat smell won't be there mm. but a lot of indonesian food has the meat smell mm. uh so like that's why I like uh, if i go to a uh warung Mm-hmm. I get like a fried food because that mm-hmm. doesn't have that mm-hmm. processed well. It doesn't mm-hmm. have the smell mm-hmm. of the meat. Mm-hmm. But here, people love to eat it because probably from the growing up, mm-hmm. they know how uh, the smell. They're used to it. Mm-hmm. For me, uh, my nose is so strong. I'm like, okay, I know. There, there's the uh, the. That's why I can't eat durian. Oh yeah, you cannot eat durian. I cried one time. Put it in that inside. I cried. Why? Because the the, the smell. The smell yeah, is, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. like before you eat it, it uh, smells like uh, mm. like a fruit. Mm. When once you put it in there, mm-hmm. and it smells like it's like vomit. You okay. like puking in the morning. For durian, once you like it, you will like it so much. But when once you hate it, you will hate it so much. No, I'm, but you need to used to eat durian. I can be. Okay. <laughs> I'm 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 on the other team. <laughs> I'm not on the durian team. <laughs> you know, in my video about durian, uh, about two million uh, views, and you know the reaction of the stra- strangers, uh, foreigners, they. <laughs> Oh, this is a uh, kind of uh, the smell like shocks, like dirty shock. Yeah, shocks uh, like uh, dead bodies, <laughs> dead body smell, something like that. Yeah. But yeah, normally from for Indonesian Asian people, they love it. Like, Any funny stories on the beach? What the English for? Or puking. Yeah. So many people people puke when uh, they try durian. Durian. Yes. <laughs> Did they do that on the camera? Yeah, yeah. You should have ca- cut it yeah, into yeah, yeah, like a it, compilation yeah. of uh, people puking, <laughs> eating durian. <laughs> <laughs> you can check my video. <laughs> my video, is, video. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Maybe you try in the wrong place when you feel um, meat smell, yeah. something like that. Maybe you, you, you come to the wrong place. So okay, so maybe, most yeah. of the places there is there won't be yeah, uh, yeah. food smell. Yeah, no, 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 no. Uh, Because the meat smell... Like is there some some of the some of the meat cooked mm. is like mm-hmm. meat smell is there? Mm. But if you go to warungs, most of the warungs when they do like beef rang dang yeah, doesn't yeah. have the smell because it's well cooked with sauce. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, so you must choose a uh, better restaurant. Sometime yeah, I think so. <laughs> don't go to cheap ones. <laughs> don't, go, don't go to the cheap one. Don't go to the cheap one. <laughs> Indonesian food is so um, is so rich with the ingredients. Yeah, That's it's. Why. Uh, In Asian mm. and Indian, like yeah. most of the Asian food is has a flavor mm. to it. Uh, but uh, I eat ayam and egg here mm-hmm. is mainly uh, mm. like Indonesian. Mm. But when it comes to like if I eat uh, bacon or something mm. or, uh, mm-hmm. other than uh, chicken, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I eat foreign food because it's uh, for me it's mm. I take I used to that mm. I can't eat uh, beef rang dang. Yeah, yeah. I can eat the sauce of beef rang dang, but I can't. Oh, eat oh yeah, 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 yeah. You are from India, so you don't eat beef, yeah. No, no, I I do eat, but it's I eat it in a Western style. Okay. Like oh, if okay. I eat, if I get a pizza or mm. if I get a burger, mm. I get a beef burger. Mm. It's for me. It's uh, for me that is taste like I I mm. know like. Mm-hmm. Now I'm like 30 years old. I I don't taste anything new. <laughs> oh yeah. So you're not adventurous about food. I I do try, but mm. I don't try the meat versions of mm. different versions. Mm. But I mm. do try if anything I can mm. actually eat mm. like a like a vegetarian or something. Mm. I try it. Mm. But if it's something like crickets, mm. uh, mm. like a yeah 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 grasshopper. Grasshopper. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. By the way. Uh, If we have a uh, dissimilarity between Indonesian food and Indian food, what do you think? There, there is similarity there. Is yeah. Similarity there because I think uh, the Sumatra beef rangang actually yeah. has like some kind of Indian flavor mm-hmm. in it. Because uh, I spoke to Japanese people mm-hmm. has mm-hmm. a warung mm-hmm. uh, in Karabokan. Mm. They said it's influenced by Indian food. Mm. I mean, a lot of the things here in Indonesia, yeah. some things are influenced because you know uh, people from West Sumatra, uh, they have. Basically, posture kind of maybe some some people like Indian. I think Middle they look East. Indian? Yes, they look Indian, Middle East, something. Okay. Not 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 all, but uh, yeah, I I can see many face look like from Middle East or India. Like Because five hundred years <laughs> ago, there is a uh, some kind of a uh, Swamiji or someone mm-hmm, like a uh, mm-hmm. Hindu. 
came here with mm-hmm. the Hinduism and ruled something mm-hmm. and mm-hmm. that's where the Hindu like actually mm-hmm. I think it's came mm-hmm. from the Hindu mm-hmm. uh, but I don't know I am yeah, not yeah. sure what do you do other than this like uh, YouTube like is anything else you do or uh, you work anything else okay uh, I own my own business uh, is a party planner or event planner or in Indonesia Event organizer, something like event that. Organizer. Yeah, event organizer. Event organizer. How is the dealing with foreigners for you? Like before, when I was in college, uh, I have part time job. Okay. I have part time job. Uh, I promoting a kind of hotel, a chains hotel. They have system about membership. So, I come to foreign people and ask them to be the member, something like that. It's kind of um, I forgot the name. I I work in Nusa Dua at the Nusa moment, Dua, yeah, okay. and I uh, approach people to be the member. So if they join the member, I get commission, something like that. So uh, meet with foreigners. I starting from from very earlier when okay. I was in college. So I, I I have many friends, international friends. That's why I'm I interest to to make a new friend from other country. There has never been a. Um crazy story happened with a foreigner for you like a fight or something you know no 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 fight just argument yeah. no, no 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 not even no, that huh? no I'm, even a, so I'm, lucky. I'm, not, I'm a nice person i'm a nice person so people <laughs> when they first saw me they will think that i'm a nice, nice person <laughs> <laughs> so no arguments yeah. at all huh? yeah yeah no argument at all but i have many uh interesting moment when i when i collab with uh, a youtuber from from other countries like you know my friends Lawrence Benson uh, how was yeah, that Lawrence like Benson. Uh, you i thought you met Lawrence Benson when he's not that famous yes 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 from the beginning Lawrence Benson i i i met him like normal like my 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 other guests i make content when the pandemic so there is no tourists come to the beach because beach are were closed yeah so i met them in the field you know, uh, Changu feel. Yeah. Okay. So I, I met uh, Lauren Benson at the moment. I offering martabak. Martabak. Okay. Martabak. Yeah. So you know, martabak is a nice topic. Yeah. I got maybe three million people watch my content about that, and Lauren Benson in one part of the scene. Okay. Yeah. So yeah. So is he? You influenced him to get into food, or he always said me. He always uh, said to me that I'm influence him. Okay. So uh, after that, because uh, the the YouTube video growing so fast, many people watch, and Lawrence have many followers from his Insta- Instagram. So maybe after that, he starting oh, his okay. video about food. Okay. <laughs> so yeah, I, I also have interesting moment with uh, the Lost Boys. Lost Boys. Lost where, Boys. where do you met Lost Boys? Of course, same, same like uh, the same. Their food. Like, they tried your yeah, food. They, they tried. Were they famous? No, back no, then? no, 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 no. Try food, but uh, one day uh, when we celebrate Independence Day, seventeenth of August, I I made content on the beach about uh, make a fun games. To, usually, Indonesian people they uh, celebrate Independence Day by making some fun games on the village. So I, I make content about fun games on the beach. So yeah, they are join. In so interesting. Yeah. India has uh, August 15th as Independence Day. August 15th. And uh, okay. in, uh, Indonesia, August mm-hmm. 17th. Mm-hmm. I just know it's the first time to know that. Okay. So, you know, Indian and Indonesia have many close relationship a long time ago. Indian always support Indonesia. And so do I. So do we. What, what do you think of Ind- Indians? I think uh, most of Indonesians think Indians are cheap. Cheap? Yeah. Cheap about what? Like cheap people. Oh, not really. I, I because I I like I imagine right if mm-hmm. I, people don't know me when I go out right mm-hmm. and um, if I go out with a white person mm-hmm. and I'm Indian mm-hmm. and people give respect to white person the, not than you. to Indi- Indian Indian oh. it's even people talking to me it's like let's say we're in a group of friends mm-hmm. and I say mm-hmm. I'm, even though I lived in US mm-hmm. I worked I made so much money but even mm-hmm. though I sit there and talking to people when mm-hmm. whenever I start mm-hmm. with the way you're from and I mm-hmm. say India and the guy next to me say uh, white, white looking guy he's from Europe or uh, USA and he says he's from USA mm-hmm. and he will talk to the white guy mm-hmm. than a brown guy so why do you think that is then um, maybe this is about misinformation about India you know India uh, in, in Indonesia famous about sorry 
dirty food yeah, yeah everyone uh, every video we watch about india is about food food is so you know uh, people make uh, food with their barely bare, bare hand, hands yeah. yeah something like that yeah Yeah, but India, uh, mostly Indonesian people love to see Indian movies every time. Also, my mom love to see Indian movies, Holly, uh, Bollywood movie. Yeah. I think. I you, think you I, I still think uh, yeah. like India has uh, less opinion. People has the very least opinion on like India. Maybe uh, people still in their perception about the Westerner. They are rich people, and because of you, also from Asia or Asia, not not as rich as a Westerner, something yeah. like that. Yeah. Like my thing is like, even like I always said this to people like it doesn't matter how how your skin look. Hmm. I think most of the people here come from like uh, other countries are. Some people are very. like less money mm, they're mm. trying to figure it out mm. but uh, <clears throat> it's, it's i don't think it's our skin you can't judge by skin if you yeah, judge yeah. by skin i mean i won't be sitting here and talking to you i think yeah yeah but yeah i mean um, uh, i think it ne- I, i try to put it out there and try to people to know mm. it's don't don't go by where you're from mm. at some point i was like people ask me where you're from i'm like i was born in india of course mm, 100% mm, but mm. i'm even my mindset is not indian mm. like i'm a guy Mm. has grown in two places mm. has different mindsets mm. even girls like uh, one girl the other day i was i asked her uh, hey let's go on a date and she's like where well, i never dated indian i'm like what is has to do with it you fucking ch- <laughs> <laughs> yeah i mean uh, yeah. the perception of indians needs to change mm-hmm. that's what i i think i yeah. i hope i can looking at me people can maybe little understand what not mm-hmm. all the same you know yeah you know even in indonesia in bali too they will give different uh, approach to westerner and local people yeah, uh, yeah because i got like if you like imagine right yeah, you're yeah. from jakarta right mm. uh, there is people from J- java mm. Mm. i heard stories they come from java mm. and they come here if if you're like a local person talking to the like a uh, mm. Uh, a person at the restaurant mm-hmm. and a white person is there mm-hmm. they will more care about the white person yes than the than the local local person yeah it's it's i think it should not be you may never know who you talking mm-hmm. to you pro- mm-hmm. the person your local person might have more money yeah than the white person yeah, yeah. or the different person you cannot uh, judge people from its cover <laughs> yeah yeah i think that mm-hmm. needs to change i i yes, feel yes, i hope yes. it changes yeah um but yeah i mean uh, Overall I think Balinese mm-hmm. are nice people. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, we we hope with this podcast people will uh not not do like this again. Yeah. I think I I I also have experience about this. In uh, one what club, is your experience? One club in Bali. Yeah. Yeah, there is when I come with my uh white 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 friend. Yeah. And then they uh like stop me. Okay. Like uh different different approach like yeah you are local and i think you don't have money and uh, white people oh, come on you can come they ask me with a lot of question what is uh, wh- why you come here uh, what do you want to order or something like that so yeah, yeah i think they are miss uh, sorry uh, they they don't believe me that i have money to come yeah i think that's that's how do you show because uh, the thing i realize is like I mean I don't want to put it out there too much white people and all that like yeah. the skin color if if even if you don't wear anything it, it just blows that's mm-hmm. why they say white privilege is mm-hmm. because mm-hmm. the skin color is different mm-hmm. even though you can wear Gucci whatever the fuck mm-hmm. we can wear yeah, yeah, yeah. you always look poor <laughs> yeah why no <laughs> I think not only in Bali yeah, in all around the world yeah i think it's the reason is like i think the western world always mm-hmm. in the media right yeah, the western yeah. world always put down mm-hmm. the asian continent mm-hmm. yeah. so that's why people has even in us like i i never heard because mm-hmm. i always drive a nice car mm-hmm. when people see i drive a nice mm-hmm. car then mm-hmm. then people think me differently i never had that kind of problems with mm-hmm. until i came to asia itself yeah Uh, when i was in us i was mm-hmm. totally fine mm-hmm. everybody gave me respect and everything mm-hmm. when i came to asia i got I'm like I got disrespected uh, ignored a lot yeah 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 but yeah. the reason I think even Asians doesn't like Asians mm-hmm. and also westerns don't give that much respect to Asians mm. which is because of the mostly the media is mm. media is always put down 
uh, they only saw the bad stuff. That's the that's the re- main reason, right? Mm. They never see the show the good stuff. Mm. Um, I think that needs to change in the media. Yeah. Uh, so I mean, I hope everybody brings the change for mm. it. Uh, yeah. But I mean, it still feels uh, feels like uh, we're complaining sitting yeah. here. <laughs> but uh, just say no to racism. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, uh, I think in uh, 10 20 years everybody has the same color mm. because nowadays everybody is uh, interracial couples mm. and everybody is <coughs> mixing up mm. the color changes the baby color changes mm. and um, there there was actually a survey mm. and uh, I seen the photos in 20 years that your kids will look like this mm. they all look brown <laughs> they all yeah, look the yeah, same yeah, color yeah, yeah. uh it, it's uh it's super weird <laughs> mm. have you been to uh any place in in outside bali in the java maybe i've been to lombok to lombok, lombok. i okay. went to giliti is there uh, anybody stop you and then they hey mister mister i want to take picture with you mister i uh, know no you see th- this is where i'm telling you <laughs> yeah you know i started this podcast with yeah. my friend lee uh-huh. uh, so we go out mm mm-hmm. and people take a picture with him hmm. they never ask to take a picture with <laughs> me i'm not kidding oh yeah yeah where in lombok everywhere everywhere yeah i never heard like a person stop on your phone and let me take a picture with you hmm. no it's always if, if i'm with a white person mm-hmm. they take a picture with in front of me mm-hmm. right <laughs> they they ask him to take a picture and i'm standing next i'm like mm. okay what's going on here? <laughs> <laughs> you know uh what two years ago uh, no one years ago uh, i i i went to jaffa yeah. i make a jaffa trip with uh lawrence and one of my 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 friend also from canada but uh she's half uh, indian blood yeah yeah she's like she's kind of indian but yeah, she's canadian yeah she was born in canada yeah, yeah yeah born in canada yeah but uh, still she gets racism for sure y- yes yeah. see uh indian Based, indian yeah. look indian yeah. look yeah so i uh went around java and in every big city kind of uh, like uh, surabaya malang semarang jogja i make uh, meet and greet and you know uh, 50 60 people 70 people come to our place yeah. just to meet us yeah and yeah Many people want to take picture with Jody. He, her name is Jody. Okay. Yeah. She's I think here. maybe I don't know, but uh, when I went to Lombok, uh, mm-hmm. see the most less tourism people there mm-hmm. trying to make money. They mm-hmm. they they're mm-hmm. not into taking photos. They're like, okay, what 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 can I sell you mm-hmm. to make money, right? Mm. But um I think so far now people at least know a little bit who I am mm, mm. uh but before I had the little 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 experiences mm. you know when I tip uh, when I uh, when I go me and my friend go mm. out we tip even I tip more uh, the person the other person gets thanked more than more I even say yeah it's little little things which mm. annoyed me a lot mm. but I wouldn't care much but mm. it's it is what it is or you know? maybe because you know there is many indians uh people that they are indonesian uh you can see in indonesia yeah yeah like uh you, you can see chinese people in yeah. indonesia you can They're see indian chindo. yeah chindo you know <laughs> chindo <laughs> chinese indonesia yeah. and also there is many indian community indian people here uh, live in bali but they are not india yeah. from your mother they country. were born here they, probably they, yeah. they, they, they born here so maybe for indonesian uh you look yeah you look like indonesian you, yeah. you, you like you like part of us so i would nothing. i would very much happy to yeah. hear that i'm part yeah. of indonesia yeah, rather yeah, get yeah. Uh, Yeah, uh, yeah. ignored <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. because i mean my friends treat me as a local they don't treat me as a foreigner that mm. which is i like because i mm. like to hang out with my friends because i i love this culture i, I want to see if there is mm. any future here for me so far the recently i've been good and everything is good mm. uh, life is actually good uh, yeah. i'm so glad people from local people want to come and here like mm. you come and mm. here and talk to mm. the people with me mm-hmm. i mean indian you know yeah you know my my ex girlfriend also indian you know really <laughs> <laughs> brother like well, you that's well, why you talk about this because <laughs> I, i have a relationship now <laughs> <laughs> it's good well, what is the future you're looking to do in uh, other than youtube or you want what do you want to become i want to be a in- influencer influencer and, huh? yeah famous also in 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 youtube and in social media and i can influence people to to know about indonesian food yeah i i am obsessed obsessed with uh, indonesian food by the way okay yeah you 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 would you like being famous 
um, this is a process, you know. Before, yeah. uh, therefore, no, nobody know me and more uh, famous, not in Bali actually, in Java. Yeah. When when I back to my hometown, in Jakarta and Surabaya, mm. people know me. When I go to the mall, I want to take picture with hey, them. <laughs> 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 yeah, something like that. Yeah. Okay, so yeah, I will. Um, I want to introduce Indonesian to the world because I'm, you know, uh, mostly Indonesian people are nationalists, you know. Nationalist, yeah. Nationalist, so uh, I people want... love their culture. I, yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm so happy to see that uh, people mm-hmm. love their culture, mm-hmm. but um, Indonesian netizens are dangerous. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> ah, be aware about. Yeah. You have, you have to be aware of what you yes. say always, uh, which yeah. is not nice always because yeah. sometimes everybody has their own opinion yeah. about things. But yeah, you have to be aware about what yeah. you say always. Yeah, uh, there is many story about how uh, Indonesian netizen is so fanatic. It's so how how sorry so it's so um, dangerous, you know. <laughs> angry, like angry. the reason I stopped putting content mm-hmm. in TikTok is that I don't want to get any. Yeah. Because uh, I I think I'm gonna kill TikTok. Mm-hmm. I don't want to become any famous on TikTok because why? Uh, because there is many hate speech. Yeah, it's always that. I mm-hmm. I don't think I it's see I can see the difference between mm-hmm. Instagram and TikTok, mm-hmm. right? TikTok is mainly people just don't know anything and just they want to mm-hmm. comment mm-hmm. and they will comment anything mm-hmm. so that's the difference between tiktok and instagram now instagram mm-hmm. is more like should i really comment because mm-hmm. i think instagram is poor people i seen like more educational people looking mm-hmm. at the instagram yeah, which yeah. is very different to they will understand what you're trying to say they will know the context of the video mm-hmm. before they say something mm-hmm. uh so that's why i'm i'm trying to kill i'm not even putting videos anymore in tiktok i mean i'm I got more views in TikTok mm-hmm. before mm-hmm. I got mm-hmm. uh, Instagram, mm-hmm. but I feel like now I have a platform, so I would rather put TikTok and YouTube and kill mm-hmm. uh, Instagram and YouTube, kill the TikTok. What's your content before in your TikTok? The same. same I never like changed. Uh, it's always oh. the same videos. Mm-hmm. I never, I mean, as far as I know, I never, I always loved mm-hmm. local people. I always mm-hmm. loved Indonesia. Mm-hmm. I always supported Indonesia. Mm-hmm. I always loved, mm-hmm. supported Balinese. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I never put anything, but still you get people where they don't understand the context of the video. Mm-hmm. The main reason we speak in, in mm-hmm. uh, English, yeah. if it's Indonesia, people will, might understand. Mm-hmm. I want my people to understand the context of the video before mm-hmm. they comment it. Mm-hmm. They comment something funny, yeah, understandable. Mm-hmm. They, find, they, uh, they comment something constructive criticism, mm-hmm. like it, I, it can give me tips, but mm-hmm. like give me constructively, rather mm-hmm. like mm-hmm. you motherfucking Indian, get out of my country. It's mm-hmm. like, that is not good, I think. Please, people, don't be like that. So that our that our that Indonesia is nice person, not only in the real world, in the reality, but also in the social media. Yeah. So please be polite, guys. People are really nice in person. I'm yeah. not. In, I'm not sure in online. I think a lot of people has mm-hmm. fake accounts. Yes, to maybe. just comment. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> which, in, Indonesia which, is a big population, number four, I think. Yeah. After India, India number one now. Oh uh, yeah, because India. Chinese they yeah, dropped Chinese, down. Yeah. In India, Chinese, uh, American. I, Indonesia only two fifty million, no? Almost three hundred. Three hundred. I almost think US 300. is there almost. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We yeah. are number four. That's why. Yeah. And Indonesian people using social media is not smart as other countries. Yeah. Country. Yeah, and also and sorry to say that. And also here, most people use fake profiles to yes. say something. Yes, Rather, yes. you use your own profile to say yeah. something, comment, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. which I rarely see because most of the mm-hmm. you can see the followers. You see, yeah. Most of the people only has zero posts. Mm. more following mm-hmm. and less followers okay. yeah, so you never had any bad experiences experiences about hate mm. oh yeah, yeah yeah i have i have um you know i make collaboration with many youtuber one of them i remember you know uh i don't know you you, you know her or no it's susan susan is uh gypsy in sneakers oh gypsy you know? and sneakers, gypsy yeah, and yeah, sneakers yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah so one day i uh i with me with Susan go to one place, some place in Denpasar to try bubur ayam. Bubur ayam, yeah. okay. You know bubur ayam? No. Chicken porridge. Chicken porridge. Chicken oh, porridge. Yeah. Okay. I need to so try. So I, I suggest her to eat like Indonesian with sambal, you know. And then uh, Susan, 
like this, like crying. Ah, oh, it's so, it's so uh, spicy, spicy, spicy. So mostly, uh, I ask Susan to try spicy Indonesian food. So the in my comment section, there is many people hate me because why you uh, try to uh, make look yeah, as to bad. Make look, yeah, to look our food like look bad because the spicy you know for foreigners what people need to understand is she is not capable of eating spicy food yeah people need to look at it in a way that it's not our problem it's yeah. her problem can't able to eat the spicy we yeah. like eating spicy we should mm -hmm. be able to eat spicy yeah, yeah yeah it's her problem yeah i i already asked to susana you want to try a spicy indonesian food okay i, I try but when i uh, give the spicy food to susan people uh, hit me why why you uh, promoting Indonesian in the wrong way. You are supposed to give a uh, nice Indonesian without spicy because she's from Holland, she's from Europe, she cannot handle spicy, something like that. Okay. Uh, How did uh, Susan take it? Susan, uh, yeah, but uh, you know, honestly, I love uh, comment like that because my algorithm. It fix it up. Yeah, huh? you get yeah, more followers. More, <laughs> yeah, more views. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Susan just just only laugh. Uh, yeah, I mean, uh, as long as it doesn't threaten you physically, it's yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, it's okay. It's yeah. okay. Yeah, just just little thing. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, uh, f with my content, I know many people from around the world. I know uh, Damien. You know Damien. 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 Who? Yeah. Who in the world? Yeah, yeah. yeah who in the he world? He gets more uh, hate comments yeah. for sure. Yeah, I know. Hey. <laughs> Uh, go 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 home to Australia. <laughs> <laughs> he gets more hate comments because he comments on stuff. Yeah. Uh, he he's been here too. Uh, his episode also did well, I think, uh, for four K or something. Mm. But yeah, we're not we're not as like we're we're a big episodes, right? One hour episodes. People mm -hmm. don't like to watch one hour yeah, episodes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, right, right. Uh, still uh, still getting there. But yeah, yeah I mean, uh, I did speak to a lot of. I would like to speak more uh, more local people. Because I can't speak to popular people all the time, you know. If mm -hmm. I don't want to speak only popular people and make it big. It's mm -hmm. like for me, I would like to speak to a person uh, who is on the traffic navigating on the uh, Omalas. Mm -hmm. I asked him, yeah, can you mm -hmm. get on the podcast? He's like, mm -hmm. I can't understand you. In Indonesia, it's mm -hmm. like, Bisa, Tida Bisa Ingrisi. Yeah. yeah, Bahasa Ingris. <laughs> I was like, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so then I'm like, I can't do it because I can't properly speak uh, mm -hmm. Bahasa Indonesia and also this podcast only English. Mm -hmm. You don't want to learn Indonesia? I, I want to, but yeah. I, this podcast only stays English okay. because it's yeah. never going to change it to Bahasa mm -hmm. Indonesia. And I, I don't think I want to put subtitles too mm -hmm. because mm -hmm. I want people to learn English. Yeah, good. And, <laughs> good. and I, want peop I want everybody to listen to this mm -hmm. whole, uh, uh, whole world, yeah. not only Indonesia. Mm -hmm. And this is the way you can put Indonesia, mm -hmm. not only Indonesia, mm -hmm outside the world mm, people mm. i want people to know about indonesia mm, because mm. a lot of the people only know bali they don't mm. know a whole indonesia yes that's why that's my mission actually yeah. about my content to promoting indonesia not only bali and yeah uh, you can go outside bali to try indonesian this indonesian food menu. this is the way you can change people mindset about yes. asia yes they, this is the only way otherwise mm. they won't understand. if you talk in indonesia mm, mm. And they won't understand it. They mm. won't know what you're speaking about. Mm -hmm. The reason Western uh, Asians love mm -hmm. uh, Western world is you can understand English mm -hmm. and they mm -hmm. speak, mm -hmm. and they like it. Mm -hmm. And you're, uh, I'm, you should keep your language, but mm -hmm. also learn second language as English. Mm -hmm. And you push your English to foreigners, and they will understand you better. Mm -hmm. And they will think, oh, this is not bad. They're they're mm -hmm. like us too. Yeah. We're all yeah. the same people. They they love to come here more, and they explore mm -hmm. all over mm -hmm. Indonesia. Yeah. And they support Indonesia. That's what I want to make sure because I love this country. I really love it right mm -hmm. now. Mm -hmm. So I want people to know Indonesia mm -hmm. is a really good country. Yes. Everybody's welcome here. Yeah. Come here. Mm -hmm. Be safe mm -hmm. and enjoy. Yes. And <laughs> don't do stupid shit. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Please. Yeah. We need many foreigners come to Indonesia to make our economy uh, yeah, increase. more better. Yeah, more I better. think Indonesia will be number three country mm -hmm. in ten years in mm -hmm. economy. I see that in the future. Um, how long you been in Bali? In I've Indonesia? been in Bali over a year. Already one year. One year more than one a year. year. Okay, yeah. so you love Bali? I ah. love Bali. I call it my home. <laughs> ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. 
yeah, yeah. I really love Bali. Okay, something that you don't like about uh, Balinese or Indonesia, Indonesia? Something that I don't like. Yeah, people Maybe are too nice sometimes. Too nice. Uh, and also, I don't, I don't know actually. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good question actually. Yeah, yeah. Nobody ever asked what you don't yeah. like at Bali because yeah. I always been the number one supporter of Bali within mm. the, my circle. Mm. Uh, because I feel like people don't understand enough the people mm. and uh, which I try to understand mm-hmm. I wish people get well with everybody because mm-hmm. the, the whatever the heat happened by Bule and local mm-hmm. I think mm-hmm. if it have been more uh, not only social media and mm-hmm. sat there and just chat mm-hmm. would have been more better than mm-hmm. whatever the create the uh, controversy it created mm-hmm. uh, but I really don't see anything that I don't like about Bali Mm. People are. I mean, sometimes you're really nice. That, yeah. That that should not be the <laughs> part. You, you, sh- you should be sometimes uh, be very well about yeah. what you're doing. That's mm-hmm. why you get people used. Mm-hmm. So you you want to be more focused. I mean, it should be nice, mm. but it should be having a boundary where mm. this is not good for me, so I won't do it. Mm. So yeah. Okay. Yeah. So I also invite you to come to other place outside Bali, maybe Java or Sumatra. I would love to, but mm. uh, I haven't. I mean, yeah. my friends are all working and I don't have friends who wants mm-hmm. to travel mm-hmm. at this point. Mm-hmm. I don't like going by myself. Oh, okay. <laughs> Just going by group. Of yeah, family. I like to go with people because that way I can have fun. Rather, mm-hmm. if I go by myself, I'm not mm-hmm. good at that mm-hmm. traveling yet. Yeah. I would love to go mm-hmm. Java and mm-hmm. uh, I want to go hike the, what is that uh, mountain? Bromo. Bromo, Mount Bromo, yeah. yeah. I want to hike yeah. that. And mm-hmm. uh, I want to... I wanna Go to Raja Ampat. Yeah, yeah. I still haven't gone. Uh, yeah, I would like to go mo- do more traveling, mm, which mm. is which I want to explore more. I don't want to go to Jakarta though. I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah I, <laughs> I don't. I don't want so, to be in the traffic. So traffic jam everywhere. Yeah. Um, I only want to visit the nature. Yeah. Nothing else. I don't want to be in a big yeah. city. I d- mm. I get. Uh, uh, I want as soon as I go to a big city, I'm mm. like I need to go to back to Bali. Mm. That's what I feel right these days uh, mm. because I don't I don't like seeing big buildings. I mm. like to see nature. Nature, yeah. Like Bali, you can see, yeah, many good view of mountain. Come to the sea only one hour from the mountain. Yeah, it's uh, fifteen minutes, right? You can go to Badbalang Beach or uh, yeah, any beach, yeah, yeah, and you yeah. can go to mountain in thirty yeah, minutes. Yeah, uh, yeah. Go to Ubud. You yeah, know? yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so yeah, you know, I I still have one idea, uh, one dream yeah. that maybe by this podcast maybe can happen. You know, uh, I am obsessed. I'm obsessed to be invited as a guest in the. You know, every 17th of August we have kind of a procession yeah. in the Jakarta Indonesian Palace in Jakarta that kind of flag ceremony. Oh, yeah. flag ceremony. Okay. Flag ceremony. I want to get there. Okay. <laughs> I hope. Hopefully you'll get hopefully, there. Hopefully, yeah. yeah. Hopefully in, you'll get there. August. Hopefully you'll do more uh, guest uh, speaking. Because you know, uh, on the next year, uh, people will uh, the capital city of Indonesia will change to Borneo, Kalimantan. Okay. You know. Yeah, yeah, I know. Yeah, I heard. Yeah. I think yeah. this year will be the last year in the uh, Independence Day procession in the Indonesian palace. Oh, okay. Yeah. So I I hope you'll get yeah. there, brother. Uh, <laughs> thank you for being here. Yes, thank you. Um, I had a lovely chat, mm-hmm. and um, please make more food videos. We'd yeah. like to watch and uh, mm-hmm. love to see more beautiful more girl. Out. Yeah, more, <laughs> more putting out there girl. about Indonesia, and people will learn about yes. Indonesia, and uh, promoting Indonesia is yes. the first thing to do. Mm-hmm. And thank you for being here. Thank you very much. Please subscribe and uh, listen to us and tell me what you who you want me to invite next yeah. and uh, what topic you want me to talk about suksama sampai jumpa uh, minggu depan yeah from me kiaki bi kita yakin kita bisa and boom baby let's go <laughs> bye